Hello everybody, thank you very much for tuning into this um, video, watching some stuff, some knowledge, Commvault knowledge basically, that you want to learn. I'll try to keep it entertaining for you. Um, so basically, right, in this little nugget of information I want to talk about um, Operation Window. Um, so what is Operation Window, right? Let me just give you an example, right? For instance, this computer here. Yeah, this computer here, right? This computer. Your, um, you work as a backup admin, right? And for some reason, you know, there's many, many uh, servers, what clients, right? Whatever, and you can't back up a certain time frame. You know, your leadership said, "Listen, um, you you can't be. Please don't back up. You know, um, clients at a certain time because." Um, we're using them basically, right? So just don't do that. So sometimes it'll be um, like midnight, right? To like 4 a.m. or something like that. Um, small window, big window, right? Sometimes it could be all day, uh, Saturday, Sunday, you know. Um, so let me show you how that actually works, right? So this is called an operation window. If any client you have or any client group, right? You can do it in a client group. Let's say, for instance, we'll go bubble gump shrimp company right click on that deal there and we'll go all tasks and we'll go operation window so any client that is on or that's part of the bubble gump shrimp company will inherit that operation window so let's let's add one right so we'll go add and uh, we'll go um, uh, um, I don't know backups right uh, backups back up don't back up right something like that no back uh, don't back up let's do no, don't back up for instance right or operation window whatever you call it right so we'll go uh, full data management and non full data meaning full means like uh, it's a full backup right non full is like anything other than a non full backup um, yeah basically data recovery you know don't really care about all these other ones, right? So we'll go, we'll go, um, we'll go don't back up. So we'll go add. We'll go uh, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Wednesday, right? Um, you know, let's let's just see this. Let's say this is a company overseas, right? Bubblegum Shrimp Company has a has a place in Dubai, for instance, right? And I know Dubai. I think I want to say they work. Um, they're off, um, I believe, Friday, Saturday, I think. I think that's how it works. So, um, yeah, we'll just factor in this to company in Dubai, right? So Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and they're off on Friday and Saturday. So, uh, okay, don't back up, meaning please don't back up. Let's start at, uh, let's start at um, 11 p.m., Okay, we're going to start at 11 p.m. And you end at, say, 4 a.m., right? Maybe they have um, cooks coming in, right? And they got to prepare the food or whatever, right? So they need to get on the Internet and communicate with other bubblegum shrimp company places, right? Uh, okay, so we'll go start time, 11. End time is 4 a.m. We'll do uh, okay on that deal. Okay. Computer froze. Oh, uh, start time should be always less than, okay. Start time should always be, start at 11 p.m., end at 4 a.m. Add. Start time should always be less than end time. Less than, start time, end time. What am I missing here? Start time, end time. 11 p.m.? Hmm, start time. Oh, I know why. Because it's the same day, right? So... Um, from 4 a.m. Oh, that's right. Yeah, my bad. So from 4 a.m. to 11 p.m. That's wrong. I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, yep. So from, yeah, don't back up during this time. Yeah, right. Sorry. 4 a.m. to 11 p.m. That's right. So it's not going to perform a backup, full or non-full, from 11, from 4 a.m. to 11 p.m. So after that, it's, yeah, go for it. Right? Okay. We'll push okay. And 
and uh, now Bubblegum Shrimp Company has uh, done backup uh, from uh, you know those days. So we'll close that out. Okay. Oh, okay. So what we're going to do is we are going to um, we look at this client, right? Client group. So client group computer uh, server. Right click. We'll go to um, operation window and we we'll, won't we'll see anything right because it doesn't inherit anything let's add this client let's add this client to this client group the bubblegum shrimp company client group right click on the computer server we're gonna go to groups and we're gonna go we're gonna make it part of the bubblegum shrimp company right click OK and Okay, so that's done. Now we'll go to Bubblegum Shrimp Company. We'll do um, View, Refresh. We'll see this there. So obviously we see the operation window. We know it's good. Don't back up, right? Let's go to the client now and do right click and you go right click. Come on, Java. Really? 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 Uh, let's see operation window and we see it's inherited that that client uh, client computer group now one thing you may be asking yourself right let's just say right that um, you need to back up for whatever reason you need to back up you're at the client now right you say add maybe you don't want to do um, for instance aux copy or something like that right so you go um, on the client itself maybe this is a, you know um, you have an aux copy like a, a, a cloud right or like a, um, uh, auxiliary copy meaning you're you're replicating your data somewhere else so you're gonna go let's say no replication okay in our case it means no aux copy we're not replicating to somewhere else the, you know, the cloud could be tape, could be anything like that, right? So we're going to no aux, uh, no application. We're going to click on aux copy. We're going to do, we're going to add again. We're going to do, um, let's just say Thursday, Friday, Saturday. We'll do every day of the week, actually. Let's do that. And we'll say, hey, don't start at 8 a.m. Um, you know, uh, let's let's do 5 a.m. right let's say 5 a.m. don't do 5 a.m. until do it until say 9 10 let's say 10 p.m. right so we're going to click OK on that and click OK so there's no aux copy essentially from that time Sunday pretty much all day every day actually right so click on OK on that So you might be asking yourself, right, um, how does this work? You know, the order operations basically, right? Anything on the top goes first. Only if it's the same exact um, thing, right? For instance, in this case, the aux copy um, would not interfere with the full Ma uh, data management or the non-full data management it would, it's two different things two different types of backups right uh, however let's just say I got another full let's see don't back up two let's say right so I want to do a full and a non-full and let's go crazy here right go crazy right Okay, and we do, don't do backups from, I don't know, 3 a.m., right, till 6 p.m., whatever, right, every day, let's just say, right, for whatever reason you're doing that. Okay, click OK. So what happens is, um, it's going to take, the top one is a priority, actually. So it's going to, it's first going to follow this rule here. So, why would you do that, right? Why would you do that? So let's just say customer says, um, 
or your company says, hey, we don't want to back up. We're doing something special. We don't want to back up from 3 a.m. to 6 p.m. But after that, you're good to go. No worries. Knock yourself out. But you already have a you already have an operation window in already for 4 to 11 p.m. So you say, well, okay, I get it. So you just put this operation window. Now, this is only in the client level. This isn't the actual um, client computer group level. So I'll show you what this is. I close this out. And if I go here to the client group here and I go operation window, you're only going to see one thing. So it's got to process this rule. Now, if this rule, if the client, which the client does in this case, the client has a different rule that's actually negating this. So the client, the client will actually run this. Um, it will run. It will follow this rule or this operation window before it will follow the um, client operation window because it's before, right? It's before, so it negates this. Uh, don't back up. Negate no 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 back uh, no backup two is going to work, uh, and then no backup is not going to be effect. It's not even going to apply there, right? So once you're done with you just like you can modify or delete it, right? You see, I think you see this, right? If you can click on it here, if you go to a client and you click on it and you can't modify it, that means it's part of the client group. But I can modify or delete this, meaning I created it as part of the client. Same with this. Same with don't back up too. But that's another reason why or how you know if your your operation window is a, you know where is it pushed out of is it the client um, client group push you know operation window or is it my local client uh, operation window so a little bit of tid information tidbit information on that so of course you know um, bubblegum shrimp company is going to get their data backed up right in, in a timely manner so thanks a bunch for um, you know watching this video in Commvault um, please hit the like button and please hit the subscribe button so that I can, um, you know, create more videos. Of course, I'm creating videos any anyway, right? Even if you don't hit the subscribe button or the like button, I'm still going to create more videos. That's just me, right? But, I'd, you know, it's good if you do because that just means I, I have more subscribers. And I think um, that's a good thing. You know, you, you want more. That means, like, hey, people are paying attention to my content and they like uh, what I do, you know, and um, so I share it. So thanks everybody for um, watching this.